smells delicious. Garrett popcorn. That's some seriously good popcorn. Look at that line. I have to come back later. <laughs> oh, I have a destination in mind. It's sugar. Sunglasses. Oh yes. Oh yes, Chicago. All kinds of Chicago souvenirs. Chicago sports. Sports shirts and paraphernalia. Oh, this is cool. This is very cool. Oh, this is mesmerizing. Very relaxing. Could look at this and kind of just oh, chill out a little. Very cool. Very cool. This is sad. Margarita Bell. Jimmy Buffett just passed away. I forget if it was yesterday. I think it was yesterday or the day before. Jimmy Buffett's Margarita Bell. Makes me sad. Yeah, at least the restaurant lives on and the music lives on and the legend lives on. Just, we've lost too many legends this year. Very sad. Pot belly sandwich. I don't think you come to Chicago to have pot belly. There's too many other good things. Pizza, hot dog, Italian beef, Ben and Jerry's. There's the lake up there. Frankie's Pizza by the Slice. Big bowl. Big city chicken. Chicago's a big city. And that beautiful lakefront. Made in Chicago. <laughs> this is all handmade items, jewelry, accoutrement, spices, I think, or I think it's spices. I don't know, it's like some <laughs> essential oils, a little bit of everything. Beats Kitchen Lantina. Looks good. Again, not what I come to Chicago for though. <laughs> Te amo. Boba and dessert. Ooh. Macarons. Oh my gosh, look at all that good stuff. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yummy. What's over here? I don't. Crush Mediterranean. Salt halal burgers. There is a theater on the lake. Up those stairs. There is Kilwins again. Not really a Chicago thing. We even have Kilwins in Texas, but boy, does that stuff look good? Woo! Look at those apples. How do you like them apples? <laughs> I crack myself up. <laughs> Woo! Oh my god, I can't begin to guess how many calories are in that. Sure looks good though. <laughs> Killings. Still working on getting to my destination. It's a big cruise ship. Not a cruise cruise ship, but a ship that cruises Lake Michigan and you can have dinner or brunch on it. I think it's the Yeah, that's the Odyssey. The Odyssey. They they are in a few cities. They have these ships that you can dine and sail on. 
Very nice. There's an incredible art gallery over here. Another. <coughs> Another Chicago souvenir shop. Lots of Chicago souvenir shops on Navy Pier. Get just about anything you want. Anything you need, anything you don't need, but you still want it. <laughs> I kind of like that one. That one is going home with me. <laughs> and, you know, Chicago celebrates Al Capone, even though he was a bad guy. Any kind of Al Capone souvenirs you need, <laughs> you're going to be able to find. Well, probably any Chicago uh, souvenir shop, frankly, but uh, there's an abundance of them here on Navy Pier. Chicago Fire Department. Everything Chicago. So, bing. Chicago impressions. Hmm. Anyway, that's just one gift shop. There's so many more. Time to go to the next one. I've finally arrived at my destination, the Billy Goat Tavern. So this is the Billy Goat Tavern here at Navy Pier. It is not the original one on Michigan Avenue, Lower Michigan Avenue, that inspired the Chibuga 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 skit. But they just expanded and they have more locations now, including this one at Navy Pier. I've dined here before. The burgers are just as tasty as the original location. They're just a little bit thicker. So there's the menu, and unlike the original Chibuga 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 place, they actually do have french fries. So, <laughs> if you don't like chips, you can have french fries at this location. I just got off that boat tour, and I'm so hot and sweaty right now because I was sitting on the upper deck um, so I could get the best view of everything. So there's all these places to dine here. Ferry Carries is a Chicago institution. Of course, Giordano's Pizza is a Chicago institution. But me, no. I gotta come to the Billy Goat when I'm in Navy Pier. <laughs> I discovered the Billy Goat um, burgers last year and I'm hooked. I'm absolutely hooked. It's like I never um, had these all the years I lived here. So every time I come now, I have to get them. Whew, it's a hot day. So I'm gonna dive in and show you what this one looks like. I did a video already on the original Billy Goat, so if you haven't seen that, check it out. But now I have something to compare it to. <laughs> I just realized I'm also a little sunburned. I had sunscreen on, but it's a hot one out here in Chicago today. Hot time in the city. So, anyway, here we so go. here it is. And actually, you know what? The last time I had this, I thought it was thicker, but I now realize it's actually two patties. Um, I still feel like it looks thicker than the one I had at the original a little bit, but... I thought it was one patty before. I guess I didn't notice it was two. I was too busy enjoying it. All right, so this is it. Mm, so, so good. Gonna enjoy that at the end of this. All right, here we go. Yum, 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 yum. Going in. Oh, it looks so thick. I think this is the best burger on the planet. Billy Goats. Oh my gosh. So good. So good. So at this location, and probably the other locations as well, you can get french fries, and their french fries are really, really yummy too. Mm. So, if you're ever in Chicago and you get to Navy Pier, you've got to come to Billy Goats. You will not be sorry. Or go to the one on Lower Michigan, the original. But there, you cannot have fries. No, no fries. Chips. No fries. So, if you prefer chips, go to the original. If you prefer fries, come to Navy Pier. Oh. You can also get Coke. Or Pepsi. You can get whatever you want. Either way. If you come to Chicago, you cannot leave without going to Billy Goat's Tavern. I promise you, you will not be sorry. So good. No, yeah, I don't, I don't, I can't put my finger on it. Definitely the beef is incredible, but I'm telling you, the bun, I think, I think the bun is what makes it. 
it's just it's just the best hamburger bun I've ever had. I don't know. It's I think it's the combination of the beef and the bun. It's just oh my god. They actually have an outdoor stand as well where you can get cocktails and drinks. I don't see food though. So I think this is just a bar outside on Navy Pier, right next to where people go on the, the windy sailboat. So I might have to do that on another trip. Scan codes next to all of these. I guess if you want to order them, you can order them. Very cool. He has a few more. Look at this one with the plane. That's awesome. Oh, that's beautiful. With the skyline in the background. Gorgeous! It's a little lighthouse out there from Lake Michigan. At sunset. Well, there's a gelato place here at Navy Pier, and being Italian, I can't pass up a good gelato place. So I'm gonna have to give this one a try. Yum, 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 yum. That looks so, so good. Can't wait. I went for the uh, Dolce de Leche here. So we'll give this a try and see how it is. It seems to have that perfect creamy consistency for gelato that you don't get with regular ice cream. So give it a try. Oh. That's just terrible. That's just absolutely terrible. Hmm. <laughs> I'm kidding. It's delicious. So there's the Navy Pier Ferris wheel. Being a crazy holiday weekend, the lines are incredibly long to ride it. So I'm not going to be riding it on this trip. I'll have to do it on a future trip. But for today, I've done your typical Navy Pier things. I've gone on a boat ride. I've had a good meal, did a little shopping. You can see it moves very, very slowly. I can hardly tell that it's moving, actually. There's just people everywhere. Everywhere! So, next time. <laughs> I don't know if you can see it back there behind me, but um, yeah, let's get to wait for another visit. So this visit was pretty successful. Went on a boat ride, had a great meal at the uh, Billy Tavern. Did a little shopping, bring a few Navy Pier souvenirs home. And now I gotta get in the taxi and get back to the hotel and get ready for the evening festivities. So all in all, a pretty successful day. Even if I couldn't get on the Ferris wheel this time. It's okay. It's okay. To be continued, maybe here. Next time. They even have water taxis here that will take you across to where the uh, some of the museums are. So that's kind of cool. Once you get yourself in the Navy Pier, you can just taxi it on over on a water 